Hello to all your comic book readers out there, Mike from Comic Prime here, and welcome to my comic review of the all new Marvel Now book, and flat out book of the week goes to The Punisher, issue number four, where The Punisher got kidnapped by Electro, and taken him back to the Dull Souls, and uh, getting uh, questioned by their leader. So, uh, starts off where Electro is using those vaults to torture the Punisher, actually. And, uh, the guy that's the leader there, like, he's just saying, you know, like, his empire will be his, and, you know, like, you killed Hector and destroyed my drugs and blew up one of my buildings, so he's just gonna sell him, you know, on, uh, eBay, but he doesn't want Electro to kill him. By the way, here's some artwork, which I want to show you, which is drawn excellently, actually. So, and they also, I like how, with Electro's powers, like, uh, it brought him back to his memories of uh, his family and stuff like that. But he just gets tortured, like, with so many vaults, and it's just really very painful. So, uh, there's also a uh, talk scene they have where, um... There's uh, other stuff that happens, and if you want to know what that is, read the comic book. So the Punisher manages to get out of the whole uh, thing where he gets tied to the chair, where he falls down and the chair breaks, which is actually a really awesome uh, escape move that he did. So when he escapes, uh, the Punisher gets all the guns, and he just shoots them. And um, they now want to move to Site B, both Electro and... Uh, Mr. Delso. That's the guy's name of the leader, Mr. Delso, actually. So, uh, he goes there and he tries to, uh, find them. And he tells Tugs about, uh, this whole thing of uh, what's going on. And, uh, also that Electro wants to cause a blackout in the city. So that way he can strike and kill, uh, Frank Castle. So, basically, what, uh, he does is that, uh, he just wants to uh, not let that happen. So he goes to the Delso Site B. Electro uh, doesn't want to be ordered around by Mr. Delso. So he just says, look, I'm the only one that does stuff. And you don't tell me what to do and everything. So they had a little bit of a uh, fight with each other. And here's the thing that really got to be the best thing in this comic book. At the end, in comes in. Domino. Yeah, so that's another Marvel U character in the Punisher comic book. Like I said before, guys, first Electro, now Domino. There's a lot of Marvel U characters that are going to be in this book, which is actually uh, one of the reasons why this is uh, Book of the Week with, you know, with Electro and everything. It does get a definite 5 out of 5 with amazing artwork and uh, the story about Electro and the black guy. I just want to see how now Domino is going to play an effect to this. And if you want to know why she's involved, just read the comic book. I just don't want to give too much away because this is a comic book you guys have definitely got to read. I mean, The Punisher is now on the West Coast. This is where the story picks up and gets really exciting. And I'm really enjoying this comic book. Definite and highly recommended from that. So with that, guys, that is my comic review of The Punisher, issue number four. Don't forget to check out Comic Related and ComicFrontline.com to get away on all source sources for Comic Related news, reviews, and a whole bunch more. Subscribe to us on Comic Front, uh, Frontline today. Almost had that little mix-up there. Uh, where we have videos for you guys. Comment below if you've been reading The Punisher, your thoughts, agree or disagree, questions, anything. Leave your voice be heard in the comments. Because I love comments, love hearing from you guys. I'll try to get back to you guys as soon as I can. So with that, Mike from Comic Frontline saying take care, keep watching. I'll see you guys in the next video. Take care, everybody.